Hello and welcome to the video on impact learning communities at ODU for the fall 2020 semester. I am Keith Krepko and I'm an advisor for the College of Sciences and I'll be walking you through the presentation. So first I want to just kind of talk briefly about what a impact learning community opportunity is at ODU. Uh, this opportunity is eligible for incoming freshmen. It is only for the first semester. So we only offer it for the fall, and it really is designed to help assist in student success uh, and in their transition into ODU and more generally into the college experience. So I am going to do a brief overview of what the program uh, looks like, and then we'll talk specifically about uh, what it looks like for each of the majors that we offer it for. Um, and then we will show you where to go if you are interested to get signed up. Up front, I do want to say that this opportunity is limited to psychology and to students who are interested in marine biology and who are interested in medical school uh, and interested in veterinary, dental, uh, physician's assistant, or pharmacy school. So that is the range of opportunity we have here at ODU. And without further ado, I'm gonna kind of get into more specifics. So first, the overview. Again, like I said, impact learning communities uh, have shown that students have higher GPAs uh, in terms of first semester in an ODU uh, on average, as well as can help adjust to the college experience a little better. And the reason for that is because the opportunity links students together in a selection of courses. These courses will not make up your entire schedule. It is just a one credit learning community course that is going to be specific to your field of study, like psychology, or to your career goals. If you want to be a veterinarian or a dental um, uh, school uh, applicant or pharmacy or um, what did I leave out? Physician's assistant. So uh, we'll be kind of looking more about that in, in depth later on. Um, but we will link you with courses that you are then going to take with that selection of students, the students who have opted into a learning community. Um, also, you will have access to an upperclassman mentor. Uh, so this mentor is going to create out of classroom opportunities to come together to do study groups or work on study skills, time management skills, things like that, and also be available as a resource for you as you transition to ODU in the fall semester. Um, there are, again, four learning community opportunities that I kind of addressed up front um, that I will now be talking about more in depth, starting with psychology. So if you are a psychology student and you want to take advantage of this linked course opportunity and that, again, upperclassman mentor, um, this will be taught by Cynthia Mecca. She will oversee that one credit University 101 class uh, that is listed here. You will also be registered for an introduction to psychology course and to an introduction to literature course. Um, again, I know, noted here at the bottom that dates are subject to change. Uh, currently, right now, we do not have final word on how fall 2020 is going to look with the COVID uh, virus situation, but you will be updated in your email. So definitely keep checking that to see if any of these opportunities have transitioned online. Next, we have a pre-health opportunity. So this pre-health um, is going to link you with a foundation to biology course, both the lecture and the lab, a introduction to literature, and again, that one credit learning community opportunity that will be taught by carry music. And again, this is for students who are interested in a pre-health uh, opportunity. Um, again, maybe not interested in medical school, but still in the health field. Next, we do have the pre-med. Um, so if you're interested in medical school, this would be great for you. Again, a general bio uh, lecture and lab opportunity, a public speaking course, um, and then the one credit university 101 class that will be taught by Ronaldo Randall, um, and he will oversee that. And again, you will be linked with other students who want to get into medical school, and he will be reviewing uh, the application process 
and the medical school path and things to be aware of as you navigate your, your bachelor's degree. Lastly is marine biology, which will be taught by me. Uh, we will link you with an introduction to ethics course and with the One Credit University 101 with other marine biology students. Again, we'll be exploring the field, different grad school programs and research opportunities at ODU. Um, so now, if you are interested, we have provided a link in the video description below that you can click on and then sign up for it. There is a separate office that manages the learning community opportunities. So you could sign up through them. And again, they will get you registered for these blocks of classes. You can you know, skip before in the video to kind of review those days and times. Um, I want to emphasize that you will be registered for these courses. They do not make up a full schedule, um, but know that that block schedule is the point of the learning community. So you cannot take just one section of the courses. Let's say you wanted to do that one credit learning community opportunity. You would not be able to take that without the other linked courses. So I wanted to make you aware of that. Because of this, we also want to make you aware to check your AP and dual enrollment credits. If you have some of those coming in, and let's say, for example, you want to take advantage of Cynthia Mecca's psychology learning community, and you know that you're going to have that literature course that you will be taking. If you have done a literature course, then we definitely want to make you aware that you would be retaking that course here at ODU. If you do not want to do that, that is fine. Um, and then we would not recommend the learning community for you because you don't want to retake a course. So for more information, just click on the link below. Uh, we will also be available for you um, during the afternoon registration period that we'll be doing that you can ask questions there as well. This is just to kind of give you an overview and then to point you in the right direction. Hope this was helpful. We look forward to talking to you more in the fall. Have a great day.